And hey guys, welcome back to the channel, back with Midwest Express. It is Thursday morning. So if you have driven for Walmart Spark any time in the past or are currently driving for Walmart Spark, uh, this is an important public service announcement for you. So this week, Cyber News had been informed by Walmart that their Walmart Spark platform has had an information breach. It was some type of phishing scam or... Uh, they call it credential stuffing, where they go in and they're just gathering up and harvesting your data and my data. Anyone that's ever driven for Walmart Spark, your information could possibly have been compromised or hacked. And what kind of information are we talking about? We're talking about your social security number, your driver's license number, your date of birth, your name, your contact information, your phone number, your email, your address, like Everything about you could possibly have been compromised. Now, Walmart says that this breach happened somewhere between December and February. They don't exactly know when. They don't know if it was installed by some kind of malicious software and whatnot, which is why Walmart doesn't allow second-party software. But Walmart's saying this wasn't the Walmart website. This was the Spark Driver site. So DDI, where we submit all your documents to, they were the ones compromised and they are reaching out and informing the ones that were compromised to change your password for your Walmart Spark app. Now, about a week ago, I had seen a person post on the Reddit page and they were talking about, hey, look, I'm at Walmart right now. This is really happening. There is someone here that supposedly picked up my order at the same store <laughs> and was using his account. And he, and when I read that, I was like, that's bull. Like there's no way somebody got your account from you. Well, apparently this is real. This has happened. There has been a big breach. So this is my recommendation to you. Change your passwords. We should all be changing our passwords every, you know, so many months, but we have a tendency to use the same password for a lot of different accounts. And uh, this is very common in America. Change your password for all your other stuff because your information, your email address has been compromised. And if you use that same password, they can get into your email and then, you know, they can get into everything for you. So on top of having your identity stolen. So, you know, just pay attention to everything because these guys are some next level thieves that are going in and stealing this information. And then I don't know if they're putting it on the web or what kind of scam this is, but just protect yourself, change your passwords. <laughs> and that's my public service announcement for Thursday. <laughs> Hope you guys have a good one. I am getting at it. I have some appointments today and then I'm going to do some late night driving. Hope you guys have a great one. Like subscribe. We'll hit you on the next one.